We are now less than an hour away from Cleveland Mayor Justin Bibb's second State of the City address. That speech begins at 7 o'clock at East Tech High School. Neil Fisher tells us what we can expect and what other city leaders say they want to hear. Tonight, Cleveland Mayor Justin Bibb will deliver his State of the City address. One of the things that everybody on Cleveland City Council is saying is we really want to understand the plan. Mayor Bibb is expected to focus on modernizing city government, economic development, and public safety. There has to be a big focus on making the city streets safe. Three News gathered crime statistics from this time last year and found that homicides with a gun are up nearly 12 percent. Grand theft of a motor vehicle is up 85 percent and arson is up 41 percent. At the same time, arrests are down. Weapons arrests are down 42 percent and narcotics arrests are down nearly 12 percent. Police Union President Jeff Fulmer and City Council President Blaine Griffin agree more officers are needed. To make this city safe, um, we got to get our numbers up. I mean, we have an academy class, I think, next week starting of nine. We need to really understand a, a very strong recruitment strategy. City Council wants to understand the mayor's plan for public safety, housing stability, and investments in the city. I'm interested to hear about uh, the education strategy. We want to make sure that we understand how is Cleveland going to look, not just this year, not just in the immediacy, but what is the vision for Cleveland 5, 10, 15, or 20 years? Because I truly believe that a lot of the things that we're dealing with um, are decisions that have not been made in the past. The mayor's first State of the City address came just months after he took office, so this State of the City address will give him a chance to talk about what's happened in his first year in office, as well as detail his plans for the future of Cleveland. Russ? We'll have a recap of that address tonight at 11 o'clock. Neil Fisher, thank you.